For people who are uninsured or underinsured, it's always scary. Not being able to get help when you're sick or wondering if you'll be turned away when you need medical attention right away. But community health centers in Texas are giving people peace of mind and healthier bodies. Despite tremendous demand, new research shows these facilities are providing high quality care, in some cases outperforming private care. Just give me your wrist. Daniel Diaz closely monitors his blood pressure after recently being diagnosed with between stage 1 and 2 hypertension. Since doctors at this community health center diagnosed the problem, Daniel has started medication and is feeling better. Let's see what it is. 154 over 107. Overall, the, the experience has been great because I went from a situation where I was concerned and feeling unhealthy to feeling much better. Daniel, as well as more than 700,000 poor and uninsured patients across Texas, are receiving help from federally approved community health centers that offer a safety net for those who otherwise may not have medical services. All of the centers are located in areas deemed medically underserved and areas of high poverty. They're different in different communities, uh, different sizes, different shapes different configurations and types of services in some cases, but the bottom line is that they're all doing very important primary care uh, work and delivering health care to folks that, that otherwise would not be able to afford it. The popularity of community health centers is fast growing. Recent studies show the centers to be more cost effective than other treatment options such as private physicians, hospitals, and emergency rooms. The community health centers provide patients with a full array of services that range from medical and dental care to laboratory and pharmacy services. The cost of care is, is definitely uh, less expensive, clearly, in the community health center environment. We uh, treat the whole patient, and I know that I speak for my colleagues, CHCs around the country, that we, we seek providers and seek a model of care that really treats the patient like we'd like to be treated. Daniel Diaz is one of those patients whose outcome is positive. He considers his health to be in good hands every time he walks into the center for a checkup. They treat people with, with dignity. Sometimes that's been the experience that I've had being uninsured, not being treated uh, well. And that's not, not, that doesn't happen here. Daniel Diaz appreciates many aspects of his community health center, including what he calls one-stop shop layout. As you can see, the medical center is located here, and just behind me is the dental building, making it convenient and easy for patients. Russ? As a matter of fact, here at this community health center, they're looking into developing models where patients can be seen when they want to be seen, not just eight to five. And they're working on setting programs like convenient care and quick access models. Russ, back to you.